All right. Hello and welcome back to the second part of drawing Adam Bomb from the famous Garbage Pail Kids. All right, so what we'll do is continue where we broke off from the last time. Go ahead and raise the fa these lines a little bit. We'll go ahead and etch in his eyes, okay? And um, make those more detailed. All right. There we go. And we're gonna go ahead and uh, draw on the pupils, but what will give those pupils and the rest of the eyes that extra sparkle will be this little dot right here. We'll go ahead and put those little dots right here. And then uh, scratch in the pupils. There we go. To give him the appearance that he's looking directly at the viewer. Okay. <laughs> and that's what he looks like. There he goes. Let me go ahead and make this line right here a little thinner, a little lighter. There we go. All right. Raise this a little bit. Okay, good. Now, what I, I will do now is make his hands a little bit more detailed. And to show that they're connected to the rest of his arms. There we go. All right. All right. Okay, erase this line from the device because his hand is covering it. His left hand, that is. Okay. okay. All right. Okay. Now the next step is to etch in the clothing. And from the way I understand, he wears like a suit, a type of um, uniform. It's like a schoolboy uniform, but it's like a suit. Gonna draw the wrinkles right here. Get this, oops, let me go ahead and raise these lines. Okay, okay. as the um, line of the um, top portion of his right arm suit jacket goes toward his elbow joint, there's a lot of wrinkles going on here, okay? There we go. Okay, I'm gonna draw a button right here to show that it's all buttoned up. There we go. Perfect, all right. We're gonna draw like a collar type of situation going on here. Make that a little bit more decent. Just one second. Give me that professional appearance, if you will. Go ahead. There we go. All right, let's erase this. All right, and basically, he has a tie going on here to make him look even more professional. <laughs> okay, we'll draw on that tie. Just we'll draw like a oval type of um, shape and his tie is like flying this way because of that explosion which is to come okay it's receiving the shock waves and therefore it's blowing it in all directions preferably to his left okay. it's going to make that tie more profound there we go this thing's just flying all over the place <laughs> there we go all right. I hope you folks are have are having a good day and are enjoying it. All right. Now I'm going to go ahead and draw in his suit jacket. I should just make his torso just a little bit narrower. Make it a little skinnier. Because he's, he's really not that big of a character. Go ahead and do it like this. 
All right, so his uh, suit jacket is like coming down here. All right, yeah. Go ahead and make this a little bit more even. Just one second. right there it will be adding more detail and reshaping that jacket that would go up like that all right All right, so we're gonna go ahead and draw in um, the sleeve to his um, suit jacket, blowing on his left to his left arm. Okay, so I want to obscure the some of the draw uh, sketch work I had done on his uh, suit jacket, but that's fine. Okay, and as those lines um, travel toward the elbow joint, there's gonna be a lot of wrinkles going on there. There we go. this a little bit more straighter there we go okay we will go ahead add a button right here like I did on the other sleeve jacket there we go okay all right it looks like so far. Go ahead and adjust this. There we go. <laughs> All right. So I'll go ahead and make the shoes um, rounder because just to give that illusion that they're up closer to the viewer. They're closer to the viewer than the rest of his body. Okay. Race these lines in between. We don't need those. Okay, I'm going to draw in the hill, okay. Okay, I'm going to do the same thing to this other shoe. Make it a little bit bigger, rounder, and the illusion that it's closer to the viewer than the rest of his body. all these lines okay great okay we're we'll going to draw in the heel portion of his um, left foot there we go or shoe rather there we go okay erase these guidelines lots of guidelines to erase all right, and now he is also noted to wear shorts, so I'm gonna go ahead and draw those in. We'll go ahead and start right here. Okay, we'll go like where the kneecaps are to draw those shorts. There we go. Okay, good.
go. Okay, good. Draw this um, leg just a little bit thicker. There we go. Make sure these draw shorts are drawn as such. There we go. Okay. Add some more wrinkles to his clothing. There we go. Give us more detail. There we go. Okay. There we go. Okay, this is what the drawing looks like so far. All right. Cool. Okay, now we're going to go ahead and draw in the stripes to his tie. Because it's a fancy looking tie. Nothing really special, but it's eye grabbing. Make sure these lines are more defined. Start with the um, head of his tie right here. Hmm. Right here. Okay. All right. That's what it looks like. Erase some of these guidelines. I'll go ahead and show that show that his legs are a little detailed. Okay, that's what we have. Okay. Okay. Now the fun part is to draw um, the actual explosion. Okay and the damage it's causing on his head. Okay, so this is the fun part. So, uh, here we go. We're gonna go ahead and erase the top portion of his head, right here. Okay. Okay. There it is, okay. Let's erase the top portion. A little bit less than halfway down. Okay. Okay, okay. I'm gonna draw the damage. I draw that a little shorter. It doesn't have to be that big. some depth to each um, damaged part of his head. Draw this a little bit bigger. Have that make that more concave. Like so, here you go. All right, now we're gonna go ahead and I'm gonna go ahead and make, alter this a little bit, just a little bit. Have this um, come out more.
go. All right, there we go. Now we're gonna go ahead and draw the stem of the, ex of the um, nuclear explosion. I just wanna go like, draw like a jagged type of um, vertical line, pretty thick. Kind of like that. Okay. And it's the cloud itself is just emanating from that stem. Should go a little lower. Yeah, I'll go a little lower. I'll go about, about right here. Okay, though. Big cloud, huge explosion. 